Bambang Jaya Kali Nampak mungkin letih bersihkan awal Pasal ini sebab Semangat pun dimana keluar Semangat pun dimana keluar Ah, betul ya Kalau pilih maka Kata kebetulan ini kepada ini Ngomong itu keluar Amen Zeh, aku tayar, aku tayar nak pergi. Eh, ni kau tayar? Aku nak buat apa? Eh, ni kau tayar ni jauh sebab tu ni kuat. Eh, mama, sebab tu kau dia mau pergi apa? Kau ni susah si fiwe, kami ni ni kau tayar. Amen. The Lord is very happy to be a very good Jacob's father. Amen. I want to ask you a technical question. Ask. Who you beat for that over here? How I want it? I don't want to protect us. Who you beat you want to? Nataka ni mpatie, nataka ni mpatie, Anto Mkiuka. Anto Mkiuka. Yes. Amen. Anto Mkiuka. 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 Where do you want to? Okay. 
Bwana Stephen. Ah, siku ya leo nashukuru Mungu kwa sababu unajibuawa. Ah. Pia nataka kushukuru kwa kulipea bili. Ah, hao wangu wadoa kutoka siku ya leo. Ninawashukuru sana kwa kutunza na kumlinda na kumlea vyema. Na najua ya kwamba tutaenda Mungu atakusaidia mwisho vyema. Amen. Mwaka nyingi kurudi. Mwaacha hapo nyingi. Rudi ni mwaacha. Rudi ni ndio sio na haraka mimi ndio nakupenda. Amen.
kita sayang sama Allah Mana sesuai Yang mana Joseph Alipokuwa anapewa mamulaka na farao Dia sema alimbalisha pepe So is a sign of a covenant Is a sign of a boy Na nataka kumbaliki pepe hizi Ini tuwedele Baba katika china la Yesu Tunabariki pepe hizi Wapendo hapa awa na mbalishana They will never regret in their life In the name of Jesus Christ We declare the blessing of God Upon them, upon every session, even as we continue. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Tunafika kipindi cha muhimu sana, kipindi cha kubalishana pete, na uru kijana Anthony de Alianza. Kwa sababu yeda, yunga kuneambia kubalishana kubalishana. Kwa hivyo, mkua wili na nyo alianza, by the way, kustana. Nani ya niyasa? Kibuli Kwa kutakali Kwa kakupali Amen Hizi peta kilipi Doku niyo ya peshi Nataka ulisikia Hii peta doku Niyo ya antu Anambalisha Peshi na hii peke kuwa ndiyo ya peshe anamalisha, anamalisha anta Sarajini tunawana mtu wa bayi peke yake, anabaya mzake Amen Na kwa hivyo tunataka Anton atukue peke yake, anamalisha peshe Na anamalisha atisoma maneno ya agani Mbilibu ya huli nswaili I know you like me, I know you feel me, I know you want a life around me. Wambia maneno hawa ya agano, kwa sababu sisi tukimalila kutaena, maneno hawa ya ya kufunga na kutakuwa muna kumbusha. Mimi, Anton. Kiunga kilonzo Kina kupokea wewe Pesius Mwani soba Kuwa mke wangu wa alali Katika ndoa Na kukaa Na wewe kutoka leo Na kwa maisha yangu yote Nita kupenda Na nita kutunza Kwa ugonjwa au kwa afya Kwa utajiri au kwa masikini Kwa mema au mabaya Nita kueshimu siku zote Tuta kapoishi pamoja Na kupa na diri yangu Aleluya Kumshani ya ba Kuda mpatia peshe Pete yake Alpanishe kiuga Mweni somba Kapupokea wewe ato ni kiuga kilozo Kuwa mwene wangu wa halali kachika ndoa na kukana wewe kutoka leo na kwa maisha yangu yote na kupenda, na kutuza na na kuti kwa ugocho au kwa asya kwa utajiri au kwa masikini kwa mema au kwa mabaya na kueshimu ziku zote tutaka kueshi kwa mwaza na kupa na diri na uku Amen Tumakalia kwa na yasa Amen, Amen, Amen Basi, tunataka kwa mariki, mesu wa mungu kukere. Sipi, the opposite side. Yes. Wife, yes. Good. You are kneeling down, kapa. Mwenyeshi. Kuna pika mkiangalia mungu. Kamafu, nashika mungu. Aya, pasal ini kan dia dah lama. Pas tunam tak berkarisye, pas tak bisa 
Tunakushukuru kwa sababu kabla ya msingi ya dunia kuungwa tulijua siku hii ya kwamba anti ni mapishi tutakuwa katika uwepo wako tunakushukuru kwa sababu ya neno ambalo limetoka kwetu na hasa kwao asante kwa sababu ya Red Strand asante kwa sababu ya neema tunabarikisha katika uwepo wako katika jina la baba na mwana na roho mtakatifu wa Mungu ya kwamba wanapoanza maisha yao ndoa katika jina la Yesu unawabariki na kuwaindoa kila mitego ya shetani na madhabao yasiyopenda ndoa yanavunjika katika jina la Yesu Kristo asante bwana wa mabwana kwa sababu utawaindoa na kuwatenda mema siku zao zote na maisha yao yatabarikiwa na wewe katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunayoomba amen baba tunasema baraka juu ya maisha yao maisha yao yakabarikiwe maisha yao yakalindwe wabariki na mali wabariki na watoto katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunavunja kila kikwazo na maroi yote yanaweza sababisha wasiishi pamoja kwa jina la Yesu Kristo tunaapisha kila nguvu za kiza katika jina la Yesu na unako nasema wale ambao tutabariki watakuwa wamebarikiwa tunatangaza kwamba wamebarikiwa hakuna mmoja wao atakufa kabla ya wakati wake katika jina la Yesu Kristo kwa neema maisha marefu wataona wana wana wao hata misafi ya tatu na kufurahia wema wako katika nchi ya walio hai katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na kuamini amen basi wapo changalie kwa makofi kwa sehemu usikaa Amen and amen. It is the time to sign the certificates. And I see a good table prepared on the other side. serikali nasema ziwe mitatu kimoja chao kimoja cha ofisi yangu na kingine cha serikali 
Na kwa hivyo tunataka tuwapatie cheti chao. Alafu waka, wataweka kila wanataka. Nataka kupatia mtu awaeke. Nataka ku kila mnataka. Nataka kilonzo kupatakea mama kuweke. Ndiyo aludi netiu. <laughs> Na kuwapalia kila mnataka. Nyoosha kwa ni mchukue cheti. Choni chet, chet, cha kuwanalisha kwa hiyo sasa kwa nani Kuligana sheria ya ten Amen Neyen Amen Antoni Kiuma Kilonzo Na Peshev Mweni Somba Nemuke na Mume Kwa njale Na kine wana Ame unganisha Nekani as nekanisha Amen and amen and amen They can dance a bit and enjoy themselves Welcome to the Missouri They are Mr. and Mrs. Anton Kiuma Kilonga. Mzeo Rudi Pango Salama. Mkifika Salimia Uko Mkoyuni. Na wewe Mzee, hawa waini na wewe pia peleka Salamu Uko. Mutawanana baadae. Mungu wabariki, MC ya naeza kaendelea. Arushi Tunaya Tuna. Jamini Mwambia Tunayo. Tunayo. Nigeoma niseme Kongole sana To Mr. and Mrs. Ha, umesau jina To Mr. and Mrs. Situafikia mwaprofi gameni Asante, asante Jamu angoso wambia ni baraka zote Mbarikiwe mtokako na mwulipo Gala zenu Nisiwa ifana nini Pungukiwa kazi ya mikono yenu izidi kubarikiwa na Mungu awapandishe kutoka upeo mmoja hadi mwingine amen amen
Nipe next, nipe next kwanza, nipe next kwanza tusifika hapo kwanza. Tutarudi tena. Leo ndio tunataka kwenda kupeli pale. Sema na dire sasa mada la Afrikaanza. Papa Fololo, Mere Kela, ona beta. Aya na kuna moto, kuna waka, kuna moto, kuna kata. It is a dance battle between the groom and the bride. How many are for the groom? Come on, come on, groom. Is anyone going to go? Is he going to let the boy not support the groom? Boy not support the bride. Kelo. Ah, song I'm going to do. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You will prove yourself. You will prove myself, sir. Song I'm going to do. Aya. How many are for the broom? Mimi yasema broom. Yasema broom. How many are for the groom? How many are for the bride? Wee, 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 wee. So, unashimia style, unadice now. Unaonesha style, nyi nyote muna zikuenda. Eh, nyi watu watuolea style. Eh, atakama unayene yu. Una watolea style, una watolea wa style, tuwana ni mshini. Sawa, sawa. Sawa, sawa. Aya, 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 aya. Are you ready for this? Tunaanza na groom. Bitte, bitte, bitte. Chuita kasi.
sini Tukapu sini Ama mujawana Wanae bakura Wanae bakura kaya abu Orogie Orogie Kiro Sikuwa <laughs> Kwa 
Kesho ni Sunday. Kesho ni Sunday. Nani katika kiao? We are doing this so fun. We're doing this so fun to make the day add flavor. Nani katika kiao kwa church anakaa kudoz? Ando, aki for the first time, mame kutatea. Boy child, ame urumiwa leo. So Kanisa, atakua kabi. Anachuanka tanks. Ule? Ando, nye yeda na aku. Amen, amen, amen. Emeni mjigwe jakula pale. Nama nipate zawadi ya kutoka kwa Ando. Hello, hello, Martinda. Yes, sir. Mama Zivani, no, Bernard Kilonzo, and Jole. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to Thank <laughs> Pulio me a mau mani mun. Wengine nukita wani mun. Moka me kondo kwe kwa uo 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 mado mo. Maye kwa kanzi amesi kamaliba la mose ni kana mbaga kama. Mato fuzani. Na tidi pa mada ngombe ni na kipetike. Na nondo ngombe lo ba wana chau. Ne kanda. Ila tangu wana chau. Na kiza kuto yu manenga. Asante. Thank you. Tega kukwetege na kama. Amen. Ah, jandina ndeto mbingi. Mwini musio. Ah, uni gomo janola tuwete leche. Chumwende ya vinesio. Na musi musio. Wina moyono otani. Nuo na anya kwe kasire nguyo kwe kasire. Amen. Asanji. Kuna anga moko masio mamu.
know you say, say you can never be the one. But God say, make I tell you say, say that you in in one month, in one week. You know I sing a new song in two days. Unless I that, you will hear congratulations. Just in the Mimi ni wa ongoze katika hafla hii ya ukata keki. Kwa basi, uh, nitawaomba kumda mchache tu naona masai meenda, hili tusi haribu wakati. Na nataka kumuintroduce mwenzangu ambaye ya tanisaidia. Mungu ni muema? Mungu ni muema? Na kila wakati? Uh, kwa majina naitwa Regina Motinda pia mimi ni mwalimu uh, niwekuwa nikifanya kazi na Anthony Kiunga congratulations congratulations patience uh, may god bless this union Asante um, ili tuweze kuendelea tutasoma maneno machache kutoka kwa Biblia na nitamuomba patience na Anton Haya maneno tunayozungumza hapa isipokuwa wengine watasikiza haswa ni kwa ajili yenu. Kusema congratulations and uh, you listen and you listen later. Nitaomba mwenzangu anisomee somo la kwanza ambayo ni kutoka First Corinthians. First Corinthians Uh, verses um, chapter 11 verse 3 but I want you to realize that the head of every man is Christ and the head of the woman is man and the head of Christ is God Amen the word of the Lord thanks be to God uh, hayo maneno ambayo yametoka kwa wakorindo wa kwanza yanaongelelea familia kama hii na kuwa inazugumza zaidi kwa ajili ya wawili lakini itasitiza zaidi kwa ajili ya the husband the role of the husband in the house uh, from that reading we are told the head of the man is Christ and the head of the woman is man and this is going to bless you, Anton, at your place. Because once people are married, uh, it's always good to know who takes which place. Babasi, uh, when you talk about the head, the head is a leader. The head is not a bully, it's not the person who takes or domineers everything. But uh, you being a leader, what shall you be required to do in your new uh, home, in a new family. To be a leader, then you have to be proactive. To be proactive means you are not reactive, nor are you passive. You are there to take control of the things that uh, are happening in the home. Whether initiated by patients or by otherwise, you take control and you don't become reactive nor passive. Two, you pursue God. And there I want to probably say much more about that. When uh, Adam and Eve, uh, you know, committed the first sin, when God came, he knew there were two people, Eve and Adam. But he never called him, he called Adam and asked Adam, where are you? He asked Adam because 
it was Adam who was supposed to take lead. So in this scenario, we say that uh, you are supposed to be the leader of that family, that whatever happens in that family, you are on the norm. These days, we're getting many things about children getting lost, they don't know what, and uh, a few other things. It is about the man to take leadership because you are the one accountable to God, uh, taking leadership with responsibility to ensure that all is well in the family. For you to really do the best lead, what, where do you get the wisdom? How do you do it? Now that you're just married today, no experience, no nothing. Then you are supposed to be led by the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit will tell you everything. So you are called to consult with the Spirit. And that is going to give you a lot of wisdom to lead in this new family. Number three, you are supposed to be a priest. You be a priest. You be a pastor of your house. You be a pastor of your house. If you are the pastor of the house, then it means you are there to ensure that the children that God will bless you with uh, pursue God. You show them, you don't ask them, do you want to go to Sunday school? No. It's like, let's go to Sunday school. You ask patient, are you feeling you going to church? No. It's about you to say, let us go to church. Because you are the pastor of the family. And as such, you establish family devotions. You are there to ensure that at least whatever a month, a week, whatever, or how often you do it, then you remember you are, the, you are the priest. What does that mean? That in case one of you, uh, one of the members of the family is in a problem, there are time for the women we get problems here and there, yeah? You should be that priest that patients will not run to a pastor, you know, to go and ask, you know, kunaenda hivi, kunaenda vile. Instead, she will be free. You will be able to embrace her and be open-handed that she can be able to find solace in this priest who become the very person to guide her, you know? Uh, in uh, natural circumstances, you find the man is on the know and the kind of as the answers to many of the questions that the uh, patients will have. And therefore then, for you to be able that priest, be able to become that priest of your home, then you seek uh, knowledge, you consult the shepherd. The shepherd is Christ. You know, before you go to run to a priest or to a pastor and say, you know, how do I handle this? Go on your knees and consult Christ, the shepherd. Is going to lead you. It's going to help you to be the best priest of your your family. Lastly, you be a protector. Uh, to be a protector in this scenario, you no. Know, when you talk about uh, being a protector, somebody feels like, oh, you should have a slap, you know, kiss with you may you may take a nasal pandesot immediately, so that nobody can harm patients and so forth. For sure, you are must line. Men are must line to protect. But beyond that, I want to advise you to take care of her emotions. You protect her not only physically, but emotionally. Women are emotional beings. They need to be taken care of. So in this case, you be sensitive to her and also you be protective. So that her emotions are not stolen. Eh? <laughs> Women's emotions can be stolen. But we're going to be there for her then you will be able to protect that. Love your wife. You will get uh, from Ephesians 6, you can consult that later. Ephesians 6, 25 tells you to love your wife. Oh, what you need to do, not much, love her. She will do a lot of other things. And do things that you cannot even imagine just by loving her. And as I conclude about that verse, I want to say that you are also a rembarrant. A reparer is somebody who is going to look for money, look for, provide for the family. And that was God given by, God gave this in Genesis 2, 15. Alimwambia Adam. That was before the fall of man. He said, then, uh, God said, uh, you go, you, you know, uh, God put man in the garden of Eden and told him to go and attend the land. And that was given to the man. Eh? So you have that God-given responsibility to take care of uh, the pro provision of the family. Now, you are one, not two any longer. One, not two any longer. And that means what? I know you are a teacher. 
No, with the education, they will place you there, place you there, and place you here. And actually, there will be a distant separation. I want to remind both of you, patience, whatever you have, whatever you do, you carry his name. You just been given a gift from him uh, in the name of uh, a ring, eh? there is his name. You protect that name. When people see patience, they want to see, is this the kind of uh, wife Anton wanted to marry? The way you are dressed, the way you speak, is that Anton? Will friends of Anton you know, love to see the way you behave because they, they know Anton and what she wants as well? Anton, whatever you have. Patience has given you a gift. You are where you are, you represent her. You carry her name. Sometimes we destroy people's name by the way we behave. If whatever you do is not something that patients can approve, then know that you are already no, not doing what she would want you to do with the gift that she's given you. And now you are you're the circle. Yeah, I want to imagine you yourself as a circle, eh? And the high is a circle. These circles have been in the point. Sasa si circle moja peke yake, ni circle mbili zimeingiana katikati kuna love. As you proceed with your marriage, increase the circle towards a circle, increase your circle towards a circle. So that by and by, and the sooner the better, it becomes one complete circle. And what that means is there are no secrets between you. Because you had a life you led, she had a life she led. By and by, the life becomes one, and we have one big circle of Anton and Patience family. Uh, as I finish, I want to read a verse now to talk to Patience, and that is Proverbs, that one, ten. Uh, Proverbs thirty-one, ten to nineteen. A wife of noble character, who can find? She is worth far more than rubies. Her husband has full confidence in her and lacks nothing of value. She brings him good, not harm, all the days of her life. She selects wool and flax and works with eager hands. She is like the merchant ships, bringing her food from afar. She gets up while it is still night. She provides food for her family and portions for her female servants. She considers a field and buys it. Out of her earnings, she plants a vineyard. She sets about her work vigorously. Her arms are strong for her tasks. She sees that her trading is profitable and her lamp does not go out at night. In her hand, she holds the distaff and grasps the spindle with her fingers. The word of the Lord. Uh, patience. I'm sure you had the, the saying that women are the homemakers. And this verse from Proverbs speaks it all. The homemaker. Although we had said earlier on that Hanton is a provider, the Bible tells us that with your own earnings, then you provide for your family. And that calls now for unity. That all of us are called to work together to be able to provide for the family. And more so, you commit yourself more. I told, what's happening while it is still night? No? And that then means that there is extra sacrifice. This man requires respect. Being the head, respect. And... Um, once you obey, I think the pastor was very clear about obedience, then she will love you. So he will love you and you will obey. And therefore, uh, I would want to ask you in your own time to go through the verse up to part one. Part just talk about who a good wife is, so that we don't take a lot of time. But I want to say that she's very precious, a good wife. And the, the priest was clear on how do you find one, and I'm sure you were spiritual in looking for her. So I will not say more uh, in that, I'm sure she will be able to reflect on the verse later. But just to remind her, women, I want to uh, speak more, eh? please do not share the issues of your husband with anyone, not even your best 
hapo. We told that kula mwa komani mwaiyo inyo katuo. I'm sure he best kept on. He ko not even priest, not even pastor, mwaiyo eli. That for that reason, mukasi okiani ya oingi mu eli mukari solve your issues. In fact, the moment to go di kwa pastor and get you see kwa the best kapu. Muida muida kuto ya na to ya ya. At the end of the day. You have the solution, and when I tell you when you go, they still come back to you and say, "Do this, do that." Eh? The doing is still yours. Eh? So I want to ask your patience uh, to just be patient and always try to solve issues with your your husband. When you have issues, just communicate, and if you do so, it shall be well. Why are we cutting a cake? We are cutting a cake as a mark of, you know, good luck. The, a cake means good luck. So if it means good luck, it means blessings, eh? So you are blessing us as guests, and we are blessing you as the as the people of Mendi. So with those few remarks, I want to wish you well and congratulations for this uh, day and for being choosing to wed in the church. It is the right way to go, and God will give you a lot of blessings. So with this now, we are going to invite them. I'm sure all of us are tende na kusaliveti na mone mano ye but it's their day. We want to ask them now to invite them. Matua this year, this is uh, their first food. And uh, I think that was not by design, it was by design that they were to taste this food before another food. Kwa hivyo karibuni sana, ili tuweze kuanda hii chakula. Asante. kwa kitu kimoja sasa tutaona wakifanya kazi pamoja wakisaidiana kuandaa hii chakula yao na watukatia keki tafadhali naomba Kinyaji, 
ili waweze kutenemsha hiyo keki na hivyo basi namuomba They know how to share this. Karibuni sasa. You share that drink. They are sharing a drink now. They are first drink after they have been married. We compliment them by before and after that. Don't forget a coffee. Don't forget a visa. Good luck. Wana kuombia God's blessings. Kwa hivyo unapokula hii keki utamke baraka kwa Hampton na kwa Patience. Kuka, this is now a private car. Private car imeruka pale private. Hakuna kusimama kwa njia at to load passengers. So what you're going to do is take this gift from Anton and Patience with love. Bless them. They will give some of these core gifts as a naupa wale mates. Now kazienu mefika. Mates, tafadali. The ladies dressed in light. Nekulia say mas. Siana hivi, siatua na umonde. Moke, nika nama kwate a gift. Kana mudinzio, kuma balama hii na niambia na asi imamu somba. Tafadali. Wana zifiwe Gaini museo Mavi ndaonde Kwa maruzi maitu Presiding bishop Na bishop wala Angi Reference Na pastors Ewa imu atu nge movea piyo Ajayi Maji ana hii Maguma mekuyo ni Iwe imu watu unge mwea Kwa ya nesa Na Kumande nge kila cha hili Aja hii Maando ni Iwe imu watu unge mwea Ni kwa ya nesa Kedha ti kwa ya nesa Umu nge titiri ya tiba Awi alama tuwe 
Tala le u museo. Eni iwe imu ya kungye mubea. Eni ache imo maki iweba. Eni. Eni mungu nyewe ya museo. Na eni uwe ya ningi mwaya ambia. Ziyo ziyo moto boe. No ni ni mwe zimu yeye manja, ene na mche ijo diwa, ene dia mche andu mwe manja, andu onda langi mwe yungi na ito, iwe mwe atunge mubea, na endi yenda na kumi anitia, na pe 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 pasta, pe referendi iba wita wa ni nyaga, ne wiki ene zamu no. Na ke gaya muadi me, na hende, hende te yuko yangu itu galuzi ni hende na na ne ba do basio, po u, ne ne ndaje po yangu ba ne po yangu ite po yangu hapa, ni te ku asante mo, asante, mukunangia mo komaseo, asante, ni pati mission kwa jili ya mombi ya mwisho, kama imsi ni gomba ni chuo, my vote on thanks, first of all I want to appreciate you for choosing me and choosing my DJ, God bless you so much, may God enlarge your territories from today henceforth. I want to appreciate everyone for coming for this wedding, to the parents, to everybody, to the pastors, ministers, God bless you so much. Service providers, water, na watambua sana, we have uh, California Studios, and we pick a cake, catering the tents, and everyone who has been part of this event, God bless you so much. That's my name is uh, MC Moishe Mungu Wabariki Sana, Tuko na Culture, the Selector, Pala DJ Wetu, Tufuate, Ko all social media handles, na Mungu Wabariki Sana. Nige mba ni upweze kupatia bishop, kwa na mefanikisha siku ya leo sio raisi ukiwauliza hao wapendwa watakwambia sio raisi lakini kwa sababu ya Mungu na ndio kwa sababu tunamwambia asante kwa hivyo naomba kama kuna mkutano mwingine inaendelea naomba ufunge huo mkutano kwa muda mfupi kwa niaba ya kumheshimu Mungu ni vizuri kumheshimu Mungu na pia kanisa na mchungaji aliyewachunga Uh, ndugu Anton nilikuwa na yeye akiwa Sunday school kwa kanisa mahala ambapo ninatumika na nikiona hivi ni furaha yangu nimekuja usiku mzima karibu kilomita tisa kufika hapa ni easy, ili niweze kushuhudia hii siku Mungu awabariki sana na pia wale ambao wamehusika watumishi wa Mungu wote tunasema Mungu awabariki sana Ah, kwa hivyo wacha tuombe baba katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunakushukuru jioni ya leo umekuwa pamoja nasi umefanikisha hii siku na jioni ya leo Bwana tunasema sifa na utukufu zikurudie kwa sababu kwa uweza na nguvu zetu na akili zetu Bwana hatungeweza lakini kwa sababu umekuwa pamoja nasi Umekuwa pamoja na hao wapendwa tangia mwiso kufika sasa baba nasema asante kwa uweza na kwa nguvu zako wale wote wamehusika kufanikisha siku ya leo walioenda kwenye mfuko zao wakatoa muda wao baba uh, siku hii ya leo jioni hii ya leo ninasema ukawabariki na ukawatende mema wale ambao wametupa hii nafasi ya kuweza Uh, kufanya hii harusi hapa kanisani kanisa hili tunaribariki katika jina la Yesu Kristo asante Mungu mkuu asante wewe unayetenda ni kwa sababu umetenda hii na tunasema utukufu ni wako asante kwa kila moja aliyekuja Bwana tunaomba kwamba tunapotoka hapa tunaporudi tulikotoka naomba neema ya safari juu ya kila mmoja katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Asante Mungu mkuu na sisi zote kwa ujumla tunasema sifa zote ni zako. Na ni katika jina la Yesu Kristo tumeomba na kuamini. Amen. Amen. And now may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ 
and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us now and forevermore. Amen. All the single ladies, where are you? Put your hands together for her. Asali sana. So make sure next time you call us with the MC. Amen.
belong to you. You belong to me. You belong to me. You belong to me. You give me my heart. Ooh, yeah. This is my vow. Can you see the 